Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Windbreaker episode 8. In the last episode we had the beginning of, uh, well, beginning, middle and almost end of uh, Sakura versus uh, Togame. Um, very good fight all in all. Like it feels more tilted on kind of Togame's side for most of it, but we kind of ended off with uh, either side could win kind of moment. Um, we found out that Togame was not always like the bad guy um, and the reason he is the bad guy today is because he kind of has has acted as Choji's like enforcer, like the one to get the hands dirty so everybody sees Choji as the fun, kind, strong leader, not kind, fun leader um, and he's the one that gets shit done whereas in reality he did that because, you know, he, he didn't want to see his friend become that, so he does like the skinning, as he calls it, and the beating people up, etc. Um, good cop, bad cop kind of thing. But yeah, uh, very much looking forward to the conclusion to this fight. So as always guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh shit, is he getting sluggish? Confusion from his fist. Wow, yeah, it is like a conversation, isn't it? Does he want to lose? Oh, now that he knows the truth of why the fight happened, he was like, why are we even fighting here? The whole audience just sitting quietly here. <laughs> Him just slumped out like that. Oh, and that's when he hopped to it, yeah. Ah, so he's the one that told him. Seeing the depth and, like, emotion and story in this fight makes you think what the next fight is going to be like. Y'all need to... Start again. You only need to rebuild your group. Right, head to the mountains? You want to train? But <laughs> you're goddamn lame. Let's go, Sakura. I believe in you. Look at him motivating the people around him. Damn. The force behind that. Sakura's a demon. You know, at least, like, pick this man up and, like, get him out the rain. <laughs> he's slumped on the floor. Bro's always had his toes out. Bro, he's crying, man. In the neck? You trying to kill him? Man, I really like this character. He's so cool. <laughs> the way he smiles after getting rocked. God, I love this kid. Oh, he's... Okay. He, 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 I think he's getting serious. Jo Togami. But my friends call me Jojo. I love like it, like his grappling and like his stance and shit. It reminds me of sumo wrestling. Oh, they are just having at each other. Oh fuck! Oh, this is probably going to be the most intense fight. Even if the leaders are fighting next, he's fucking insane. They both are. I love it. You guys are going to sleep after this. Oh my god. He's fucking crazy. Bro, his kicks are so good. How have y'all not lost any teeth yet? I love that they're all they've all got like different like types of uh, fighting skills. Nude is going to throw up. Oh. <laughs> Touched mine too. <laughs> All Asugashita is like, damn, he got the better fight. 
What do you think of this, Shoji? He's not acting really lame now, though. This is probably the best fight he's ever been in. Bro, these guys, like, most of these guys are have to grow up to become, like, UFC fighters. That'd be fucking dope. I genuinely don't know who's gonna win. I'd be fine with either side. Because it's been a good fight. Damn, both kicked to the face? Is it gonna end in a draw? How y'all knock a brain damage after this? Is he admitting defeat? Nah, oh, what the hell is going through Choji's head right now? Yeah, let's end it. You got a little bit more in you? Bro. Who? Who's gonna win? Oh, they're about to catch the biggest punches to the face. If it wasn't for plot reasons, I feel like one of these punches is going to put the other one in a coma. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, maybe that would have changed his mind. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> He's not going to purpose- <gasps> He did! He stopped his punch, or did he like? Did he have like the arm length to get to just hit him first? He didn't pull his punch, did he? How are you still not knocked out after that? Even Sakura is surprised. Oh, he's pissed. He did pull a sponge, didn't he? He doesn't give a fuck about justice. He just wants to fight the strong guy. What the fuck? That was so quick, I blinked! Oh, beat his ass, Sakura! Oh, okay, Ume beat his ass. I wanted to see Sakura hit that little bitch, though. Oh! Ume, Ume Mi was quick getting up on that stage. You're still not knocked out? This guy is hard as hell. Bro, I thought for sure Joji just put this man in a coma. Who was he saying don't die to? You'll beat him up? Oh, Umami is going to win. Time to finally see how strong this man is. That kick was vicious. To see a fight like that, Umami has got to be dumb strong. That was a dope fight. I would have liked to have known who would have came out on top of that. I think Sakura just cannot go down, to be honest. Oh, you're about to feel this. <laughs> Ooh, serious mode. Damn, it's raining again. This kid's messed up. Someone needs to bring the light back to his eyes. Damn, disrespecting your crew in front of them. That's not the reason why he looks like he's having so much fun. Because he has friends, and he treats people with respect. I don't know what the outcome would be that would actually change his fucked up little mind. Like, if he lost, he'd still be trying to aim for this no matter what. If he won, he'd, he'd realise he's still not happy. 
Oh, we get into it this episode? Oh, damn. Are you on my shoulders? What the hell? Whoa! That was fucking sick. Bro, this little guy can move. Nidia, <laughs> so what the fuck? <laughs> He's literally stone. Is Sakura realizing that Choji would have beat his ass right there? Oh my god. His movements are crazy. Those shoes are also crazy. They look like Sonic shoes. Umumiya looks beat up already. Why is he eating all this? Bitch. Oh my god. The power. Umamiya was trying to get through to him, but... What? Even him? Oh, he's, a, he's about to go Gojo mode. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Right, so that was Windbreaker Episode 8. God, what a fantastic episode that was. Oh, my God. The fight between Sakura and Togami was legendary. Um, it, It's, it's unfortunate. I mean, it's not unfortunate. They fought w with, like, 99%. Sakura fought with his all. Togami, in the end, dropped to 99 and was like, this this isn't it for me. This this is where I stepped down. This fight shouldn't have happened. These fights shouldn't have happened. But I'm I'm personally glad they did. Number one, they were amazing to watch. Number two, it's changed Togami. Like for the better. Since how he was before this fight. I don't know how he will treat the members of the group differently after this, whether he will continue skinning or not. I don't know how Choji's gonna be after this. This little this little dude can move like crazy. Um, but uh, from the first kind of few minutes of this fight, Umami, 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 I've forgotten his name, <laughs> Umamiya, Umamiya, yeah, yeah, Umamiya has, um, was trying to just reason with him and talk it out, but that's done with, he's not listening, so he's going to catch hands, um, which I'm very much looking forward to. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction today, have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.